Okay, Nick the Wrecking Ball. And there, there is that, that glorious title, and there is that brilliant manager as well, Paul Stevenson. How are we? Hey, how are you? Very good, very good. Um, I'm not sure if Paul Stevenson's in shot, but I, I'm hoping that Paul just will the voice, Dave. be just in shot. Just the voice. Sometimes that's all we need. But, but Nick, that looks good, doesn't it? It's good that you've got the real one now. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Yeah, Walking yeah. about with this fake belt. Looks good. Feels <laughs> good. <laughs> uh, what, what did you make of your man Ronnie up there? And uh, you know, Robert Diaz, uh, he thinks that you've made a mistake. Yeah, that's what they all say. You know, it's all good and well talking like that, isn't it? Um, you realise it's a different story getting in there with me, but yeah. Didn't make nothing of him really, just another opponent in my way, trying to get to where I'm get to, um, trying to take what's mine and all that. Man. There is a rumour, Nick, that you will be walking to the arena on Saturday. That's how close to your house it is. Can you confirm or deny these rumours? Jogging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, it's close. Yeah, two minutes away, so feels good. Feels weird, actually. Feels weird fighting here, but it's good at the same time. Don't know, I can't explain it. Normally, we're getting flights loads of bags, suitcases, trains, none, none of that, just uh, just me and the team and ready to go. He is ready to go, isn't he, Paul? I mean, uh, this this is a man that you see more, more than anyone else. Uh, he's ready, right? Yeah, Nick's in the shape of his life, Dev. Uh, I say that, but he always is in unbelievable shape. And the sparring, the, the training, the level he's, he's boxing at, the IQ, you know, everything's just coming on so well. So, you know, it's going to be a... a perfect performance perfect fight for Nick what are you expecting from Ronnie because he set up there you can either move out the way of a wrecking ball or you can kind of face it head on yeah. he plans to face it head on apparently what do you think you know um, he's, he's got his own sorts of uh, ideas I would think about how it goes but as I've said once the bell goes it's different um, I think say for example recent opponents I think Isaac Dogbo was surprised that he couldn't stand inside with Nick, you know, he wasn't allowed to. Um, Nick's very technical inside, knows what he's doing. And then I would imagine Vargas was a bit surprised that he couldn't outbox Nick and and, at, and Ray Ford, probably the same. They, they all get surprised when they get in there with him because he's something different. Nick's the best fighter in the world, I believe, and certainly the best in the featherweight division. And, you know, he's, now it's time. he's obviously world champion. He's, he's proved he's at that level. Now he's, he's going to go on and... Ronnie Rios, good fighter that he is, good fight he should bring. I don't think he'll get anywhere near Nick's, Nick in his belt. Is that how you're feeling about this, Nick? He's, he's a good fighter, Ronnie, but you, he's not going to get anywhere near you once the first bell rings. Is that your feeling? Yeah, well, he's going to be in the ring with me, isn't he? So, <laughs> yeah, he's going to get close enough, and I'm going to have to be close enough to, to punch him. Um, yeah, and not let that happen. But obviously, at the same time, anything can happen in boxing. I'm not stupid, but that's why I'm so switched on in there. And, you know, always listening to Paul. He switched on the best coach in the game. You know, always listening and always learning is the main thing. You know, and, and everything I listen to pays off and works. So that's what I'll continue to do. And this homecoming element, does it come with additional pressure? We've seen other fighters in the past perhaps get too caught up in it, taking selfies on the ring walk and stuff like that. <laughs> I don't think we'll see that from you, to be honest. But has it felt different heading into this? Yeah, well, it is different, and I'm world champion now. I'm world champion, going in, going into a fight, you know, defending me, <coughs> me world title for the first time. So that's different. It's a, it's at home. That's also different, but it's all different in good ways, isn't it? So, yeah. But in terms of the other stuff, the what you said, people taking selfies and all that. That you mean like get, getting ahead of yourself and things like that. Mm -hmm. No, I'm, as you can tell, I'm I'm not unlike that. So, um, just keep it the same to you know, keep doing what, what um, got me to this position. So keep doing that and don't change.